It was just a picture taken at a dinner. Jeremy Reichberg on the left, Jonah Recknitz on the right, bracketing then NYPD Chief of Department Philip Banks. But it takes on new meaning in light of astonishing dash cam video played at Reichberg's trial and charges of bribing police officers. Reichberg and Recknitz, who has pleaded guilty and is testifying as a government witness, stunningly gained access to the heavily protected underground garage at police headquarters on a restricted street. We're passing the frozen zone, about to get to the garage. Then they boast about their ties to Banks, then the top uniformed cop in the NYPD. We're going to go park in the chief of department's extra spot. Their brazen belief in how much access their money has given them is on display as they approach a cop standing guard in the cold. Please salute us, officer. You still want your job. Another shocking example as they enter the garage, a place that is off limits to rank and file cops. I would expect that the chief or the PC sent us a representative to walk us up in the private elevator. I'm expecting nothing less. Banks, who has not been charged with wrongdoing, did in fact send an escort who greets the pair effusively. <laughs> Jurors were also shown pictures and video of the pair wearing Santa Claus hats and driving a black Aston Martin to deliver Christmas presents to officers. But it is the unfettered access to police headquarters that has police experts riled. This is uh, totally outrageous. To give people who are not members of the service this kind of access is kind of mind-boggling. When you do something like this, you corrupt the entire organization. Reichberg and Recknitz have also donated heavily to Mayor de Blasio. Phil Banks lawyer Ben Bronfman told me his client would not comment on any evidence in the case. The trial resumes on Friday. In the newsroom, I'm Marcia Kramer, CBS 2 News.